What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Hercules back with another video. Today, I'm gonna show y'all my bulking meals. Well, it ain't like set meals, because if you follow me, you know I do dirty bulk. So, nothing is measured. I just kind of eat whatever I want to, making sure there's a lot of protein, a lot of carbs, and things like that. So, if you're trying to bulk up and you just kind of don't know what foods to eat, I'm gonna kind of show y'all the foods that I eat. Not on a daily basis, but something that would be ideal for somebody trying to build muscle, okay? So today, we're going to be having eggs, like always. Bulking or cutting, I have eggs with some cheese in them. Then, we're going to throw some spinach in there. Because Lexi making me add spinach because I don't like vegetables. So she been throwing spinach in there. And I don't mind spinach anyway. It's a good way to get some, some greens in, some fiber. Why not? Usually I have regular pancakes, I'm not gonna lie, but we don't have any more left. So we're gonna have the Kodiak cakes. 14 grams of protein. Look at the macros. We're at 14 grams of sugar, or <laughs> protein, not sugar. 30 grams of carbs, two grams of fat. So it's good for, you can eat these on a cut or on a book, so it really doesn't matter. That's all we're gonna have though. Oh wait, then I'm gonna have me some hash browns because I just want some. <laughs> There is no specific reason. And it's good carbs, why not? Not, you know what? It's just good food. I just want some good food, that's all. All right, so adding my cheese to the eggs. Gotta have them cheesy eggs. And then, that's how you do the spinach. You just take the spinach. I don't like the stems. Just take that off of there. Tear a bunch of them stems off of there. Chop that up real good. Real small pieces, real small. Oh, they got baby spinach too. This ain't baby spinach, right? Mm -mm. They got it. Probably be easier if you buy baby spinach because then you ain't got to do all this extra slicing up. But I just now thought of that. Haven't thought about that. They're good, babe. A little bit more. You need to put all that in there. All of it? Yeah, that's the, how I do the yours. eggs? No, you don't. Yes, I don't I want do. my whole eggs to be spinach. I just want to taste the eggs. Well, too. I put a whole handful in there. That was a handful. No. Stir it up. Lexi trying to turn my eggs into just a bowl of spinach. That's not enough. That's good enough. All right, you got that. Here you go. I'm not going to measure that out. I'm just going to guess. I really don't know the portion no more. I'm not cutting. I'm just going to go based off of the consistency of it. But, uh -oh. Baby's getting mad, guys. I'm going to have to record the rest of the video. Maybe with a baby in my arms. But I tell people, if you really want to make it good, you can add some cinnamon in there too. Which I actually, I'm going to do that today. We got some cinnamon? Yes. Yeah, I'm going to add some cinnamon to that. Throw those all together. Not together. <laughs> Throw these in the skillets. Cook them up. And there you have it. Simple meal. We got the pancake, Kodiak protein cake, some four whole eggs with spinach. And then we're gonna eat some hash browns. I got the other one over there too, but and that's meal number one. But not for you, just for him. <laughs> that's how we play y'all. I just make you feel it, make you feel. All right, guys. Hi, Lexi. Hey. We are at Chick Fil A. I told y'all, see, it's spontaneous. When I want to bulk, I don't really care what I eat. I just eat as I go. If I get hungry, I have what I'm close by. What I'm close by. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm close to. So we ride at Chick-fil-A. So we're gonna have some Chick-fil-A while we're out because we gotta get some Christmas shopping done. And I'm gonna show you guys what I'm having. Yeah, I need at least two mayos. And then ketchup. Thank you so much. Thank you too. Oh, that's a big bag. We gotta work. Look at this bag, y'all. This is ridiculous. No, I got no warrant. Be quiet. You always talk shit. <laughs> She told me, do I got a warrant? Because I know this is like five other people just sitting in their cars out here. I might need to uh, knock on a few windows. All right, guys, let me show you what we have. And we got a spicy chicken. Did you get spicy? Yep. Spicy chicken with cheese. Of course, we got our, ourselves some waffle fries. They're nice and crispy. Then I got another one. Damn, right there, two of them. So. No, I'm about to eat good. About to slam on this. And then we got some shopping to do, so 
That's meal number two. Family, we back at the house. Time to show y'all what I have for meal number three. We having a whole pizza. I'm already halfway done with it. Cause I forgot to show you guys. <laughs> I'm just playing y'all. That's not what I'm having. This is what we having right here, y'all. A nice box of Frosted Flakes. I'm actually about to be going to the gym. I usually work out early in the day. But today I had things to do. We had to shop for the girls, shop for Christmas. So I got to work out late tonight. It's been a long time since I did it. So we're gonna have a bowl of Frosted Flakes and some fruit so for some fast digesting carbs so we can go to the gym and hit this workout. I was gonna do a peanut butter and jelly, but I noticed sometimes they don't sit too well when I eat PB&Js before I go to the gym. So like I said, we're just gonna do a bowl of Frosted Flakes with some fruit and then we're gonna head to the gym probably in the next hour or hour and a half, something like that. So see, I can have fun guys. I'm not on a diet. So bulking is a lot easier. Like I said, I don't track anything. I just pretty much eat intuitively. We got the 1% milk. I just pretty much eat intuitively, man, and just you know make sure I'm getting enough protein, eating plenty of carbs, definitely no limit on my carbs right now. So just having fun with it. I'm still young, so why not? Y'all have it, guys. Like I said, nothing fancy, nothing special, but it gets the job done. Let me just big ass bowl of cereal and these grapes. That's gonna be the pre-workout meal. All right, guys, just got back from the gym. So I'm gonna do my post-workout shake. I'm gonna do a whey protein shake with some creatine. I do five grams of creatine daily and some glutamine for recovery, which I just started doing. If y'all follow me on Instagram, I talk about this on my story. I went like my first two years of training without glutamine. I've never actually supplemented glutamine. So I've been kind of missing out on the recovery benefits. But hey, I got this far without it, so whatever. Come up here, baby. We're gonna do two, no, we're gonna do a scoop and a half. This protein been making my stomach hurt lately, so I don't wanna do overdo it. But we're gonna have this, and we're gonna call this a snack instead of meal number uh, four. Cause I think I've showed three meals so far. I can't remember. But we're gonna do this. And then I'm gonna have my fourth and final meal, probably in about 30 minutes or so, we'll see. Got all that in the cup. We're gonna shake that up, and we're gonna have this shake. And then I'll come back and show y'all my fourth and final meal. All right guys, and this is gonna be the fourth and final meal. Now, honestly, I'm really not even that hungry, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but I've been plateauing lately as far as my bulk. I've been stuck around 211, which is fine because I kind of got there too fast. But this is one of those situations where I'm hungry, but I'm not super hungry. So I kind of got to force feed a little bit because it takes that to grow. Your body only want to let you grow genetically so much. So I got to kind of force in these meals. But this is going to be the fourth and final meal. We're going to do two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I'll let y'all in the secret. Since my first bulk, these have been, I've ate, I eat two peanut butter jelly sandwiches every day. I've been, haven't I been doing that for like, I've been doing that for like two years. Like, I stick to this. Like when I had a job, everybody knew about my two PBJs. They was like, Vail, you're gonna have your two PBJs today? I'm like, yes. Bulking, this is how you get the gains, all right? Two peanut butter jellies and chocolate milk. I don't have that today, but that's the secret for y'all. High carb, high protein, good calories. We're gonna have a bowl of strawberries, just a small one. Just to get those fruits in, because mama said I gotta eat my fruits and vegetables. But to backpedal, side note, he makes the best PB&J sandwiches, but they're amazing. I don't make them for myself no more. I make hey, him make them for me. It's all about the jelly to peanut butter ratio. I can't tell y'all what that measurement is. It's top secret. If you want a peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, I'm gonna put the link down here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing. Hey. If I get enough people asking for it, I'll start send, selling these and sending them to your house, packaged up. All right? <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna close the video out. Thank y'all for watching the video. I just wanted to put something together so I could have something to upload, because my uploads haven't been as frequent lately, because Lexi ran out of commission. But the baby's here. She's ready to go. She'll be back in the gym soon, so I'll get some more videos for you guys coming. All right? Once again, thank y'all for watching the video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. If you want any workout plans or nutrition guys, head to the website, iHeartGeniusBasedFitness.com, down here. Go check it out. 
and get yourself right. That's all I got for y'all today. Hercules out.